Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today we will be drawing a lobster. So I really hope you like it and let's get started. So I'm going to be using a Sharpie and later on I will be using color pencils. And if you are new to my channel and haven't been here already, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video for you every single day and along the way while we draw I will give you some fun facts about everything that we draw as well so you can learn something while we draw Also, if you have any requests for me to draw for next time, please let me know by commenting below and I will draw that for you for next time. And if you want to connect with me uh, or send me your drawing to get featured in, your, in my next upcoming video, please don't forget to send it to my Facebook or my Instagram account. All the information is in the description box below for you. And now that we are done with the like the face or like the eye area of the lobster and then I'm going to add the middle part first and then we'll go into the legs and the, um, the claws at the front and then we'll go into coloring I will be using color pencils however you are free to use whichever color medium that you want to use so today to give you fun facts I will be using catalinaop.com uh, just to get the fun facts, I uh, thought that this website has some fun facts, so I'm not sponsored by it or anything, just reading the fun facts because I thought these were pretty um, good facts to learn about lobsters. So apparently lobsters can live as long as 100 years. And the American or Maine lobster is found in Atlantic Ocean and bears large meaty claws. Species of spiny lobsters such as California spiny or spinny, uh, whichever, uh, let me know if I said that wrong, have large um, antennas but nor, no large claws. So uh, if you are from Canada and in maritimes they do lobster fishing so they know a lot about lobsters and they sometimes catch like blue lobsters as well some of them come in blue color they are rare apparently and it's the main thing that they do so um, it's pretty interesting and perhaps due to being closely related to grasshoppers and tarantulas Lobsters are often referred to as bugs. They do look like a bug, especially when you're drawing it, you realize how closely related they are to a bug. Um, for me, when I'm drawing it, I also drew um, a um, uh, scorpion. So uh, kind of similar to the shape of the scorpion as well. Um, so I will put that in the I button up top as well so uh, you can see um, but um, I thought it's a similar way of drawing uh, but apparently they are called bugs and closely related to grasshoppers and tarantulas so spiders uh, a female lobster can only mate just after she has uh, molted once she has shed her shell she sent out a pheromone to let males know she's in the mood so there you go and when lobsters mate the eggs and fertilize right away the female carries the male's sperm and chooses when to fertilize her eggs depending on how cold the water is female lobsters may carry their eggs for up to a year interesting right and also Lobsters taste with their legs where uh, chemosensory hairs that identify food. 
I find these things very interesting because they are very different from what you would think um, and uh, very like fun facts to learn and know and uh, I didn't know that before so I thought this is a very a nice fact to know about lobsters and also they also chew food with teeth located in their stomachs which are right behind the eyes and about the size of a walnut another interesting fact that is unusual lobsters are cannibals when food is scarce they are known to dine on smaller lobsters so they do eat each other which is a little scary and lobsters don't scream when you cook them so a lot of people think that when you put a lobster into the water that sound that it makes is that they are screaming but they don't have lungs or vocal cords According to Robert C. Baer, executive director of the Lobster Institute at the University of Maine, the noise people hear in air that has been trapped, noise people hear is the air that has been trapped in the stomach and forced through the mouth after being out of water for short periods of time. And that's what makes the noise. So now you know and the creamy green stuff inside a lobster is called the tomali a digestive gland that's the intestine liver and pancreas um, and its appearance may be off-putting but many people enjoy eating it and consider it delicious i would not want to eat that but that's just me a lot of other people love it and lobster blood is clear when cooked it turns into whitish gel otherwise it's just clear so going back to the drawing we are almost done with the drawing we're just adding in the legs and then we'll go into coloring so i hope you're finding this easy to draw so far um, it's a very easy drawing to draw it's just very detailed a lot of detail is in there uh, because they have like a lot of legs and they have those claws um, and the body area as well is a little different so it's just details but drawing it is very easy So once upon a time, lobsters were once considered poor man's food. In colonial times, the crustaceans were so plentiful in the Northeast that they were often used as fertilizer, feed for farm animals, and as fishing bait because they were so cheap. They were only eaten by poor people and served to prisoners and servants. Now though, lobsters are very expensive um, and they are not a poor person food anymore. Lobster meat is a great source of protein providing 28 grams of protein per cup and if you skip the butter, they aren't fattening. Three and a half ounce have just 96 calories and about two grams of fat. So there you go. Um, and lobsters can regenerate their claws, legs, and antennas. Um, so those are the fun facts that uh, this website offers, which are very interesting. Um, and I learned a lot from that that I did not know before uh, especially about their taste buds being in the legs um, I didn't know that and a lot of other things as well um, like that uh, that they have teeth located in their stomachs 
um, that is pretty interesting that I find um, because not a lot of animals or creatures or bugs have that feature have their teeth in their stomach uh, which is pretty interesting so uh, there you go some fun facts and I really hope you like it now that we are into the drawing part you can see that I'm coloring it orange because most of the lobsters that I've seen either orange or like a really dark dark brown color so now that I showed you that I'm going to show you the full color drawing so this is the full color drawing I really hope you like it and enjoy the video and the fun facts and if you want to buy products with this lobster on check out my Redbubble shop link in the description box below um, to get products or even just to see how they look uh, with this lobster on and if you are liking this video please don't forget to hit that like button and leave a comment for me and I put some next videos for you to enjoy next and also don't forget to hit on my face logo to subscribe to my channel I bring a video every single day to you so I really hope you enjoy this one I will see you tomorrow bye